Where are we? Let's talk We're about... We're on to Steam News. Let's talk about the Steam families. Hello! We are excited to announce Steam Families available today in the Steam Beta Client. This is how you're going to take all of my games. Yes. And you're how you're going to look at my library and go, okay. I'm going to laugh. <laughs> Uh, Steam Families is a collection of new and exciting family-related uh, features. It replaces both Steam Family Sharing and Steam Family View, giving you a single location to manage which games your family can access and when they can play. Uh, to get started, you can create a Steam family and then invite up to five family members. You can manage your family uh, from your Steam client, mobile device, or web browser. Uh, family sharing. When you join a Steam family, you automatically gain access to the shareable games that your family members own, and they will also be able to access the shareable titles in your library. Hold on, shareable titles. I think not all titles will be shareable. Like, the developer has to, like, enable that. That's a little concerning. Well, I, I'd imagine maybe multiplayer games. Maybe Yeah, there might, there might be an issue there. Mm-hmm. Uh, the next time you log into Steam, this new uh, family library will appear in the left column in the left column of a subsection of your games list. You maintain ownership of your titles, and when you purchase a new game, it will show up uh, in your collection. So, so the chat is saying that it's opt out. So I think that means that uh, it's enabled by default that you okay. can do the family sharing, but a developer can opt out if they don't want to do it. Okay. Uh, best of all, when you start playing a game from your family library, you will create your own saved games, uh, earn your own Steam achievements, and access uh, to the workshop files uh, and more. Family sharing enables you to play games from other family members' libraries, even if they are online playing another game. If your family library has multiple copies of a game, multiple members of the family can play the game at the same time. For more detail, look at how family sharing works. See the FAQ below. So we both have like Half-Life yes. 2 or whatever. Yeah. So that means if we had four people on our plan yeah and we had two copies of half-life 2 that then means... two people can play half-life yes. 2 that's pretty at the same time yes that's pretty cool uh yeah family sharing is uh is a feature that developers uh may opt their games out of for technical or reasons uh at any time uh parental controls uh i mean we're not kids <laughs> yeah we don't care about we that. don't care about that uh, child purchase requests. Uh, oh, this is concerning. I'm a dad. Oh, we, no, this is kind of this is a good idea, actually. We understand a common and sometimes time-consuming task for parents is purchasing games for their children. They usually require that parents complete a gift purchase or let their kids borrow a credit card. To streamline this process, family uh, Steam Families introduces a new payment option where a child account can request an in-family adult to pay for their shopping cart. The adult can approve and pay for the purchase from their mobile device or email. Once approved, all games from the shopping cart will be added to the child's account. That's kind of cool. Yeah, that's kind of a cool idea. That'd be cool to have. That'd be cool for Apple to have. That'd be cool yeah. for any like yeah. software-based yeah. company to do. So yeah, you can join. Uh, it's in beta right now to test the new uh, families feature. We need to opt into the Steam Family Beta. Oh, we need to. Okay, let's. I'm I'm going to Steam right now. All on, right, on my Mac. I'll we're let gonna, me pull out my Steam right Deck. <laughs> so here's the thing. Uh, you can jump between families, but yes. you have to uh, wait a year. Yes, I think when you leave a family, you have a whole year before you can join another family. Here's what it says in the FAQ: Steam families are intended to contain your immediate family. As major life events can change who lives in your household, it is understandable that someday you may need to join a new Steam family. Oh my god! This is so Adults weird. can leave a family at any time. However, children uh, cannot. That sucks. Yes. Uh, they will need to wait one year from when they joined the previous family to create or join a new family. Children. Oh, okay. Children cannot leave a Steam family um, themselves and must be removed by an adult in the family or by Steam support. As it is rare that a family member leaves the family, each Steam family member slot has a cool down of one year before a new member can occupy that slot. Uh, okay, that's more reasonable. So, so yeah. one year from joining the initial family. So yes. a year from now, you can jump ship and immediately join another family. Yes. Okay, that makes a lot of sense. So there's only five people that could be in a family. Yes. So you got two kids. Yes, they don't have. We're, we're two people. Yes, so that only if, eventually they might need to get on Steam. Yes, you know, eventually. So then there will only be one slot. Left. Well, we're gonna start them with a real system like a Switch first. Okay, and then well, now a Switch, 
has eight family yes. members <laughs> in the family yes. plan. So there's, I think it's just the two of us. Oh, and <laughs> Hannah. Hannah's on <laughs> okay. it. Okay. So that was, that, was a, that was a whole thing. I was like, I think it's time to... I think it's time to, to edge in my to, to make a big step in our relationship. <laughs> I'm gonna put you on my, on my Nintendo Switch. See, see, back in my day, it was combining our DVD collection. Ooh, <laughs> yeah. well, that's a sacred place for yeah. you. Yeah. Uh, I don't think I have the option. Steam client. Oh, Steam client beta participation. Uh, where do you I, see that? In the it's under interface. Interface. I don't know if you're gonna see it on your phone. I don't know. I'm, I'm gonna show this on screen right here. So we got it here. Uh, client beta participation. No, it's not. Uh, right. Steam, Steam Families beta. It's right there. Okay. Do it on your Mac. Yeah, I'll launch Steam over here. You go to settings. You go to interface. Steam Families beta. Restart required. Do not restart my computer. I will kill you, Gabe. <laughs> oh, it's restarting Steam. That's fine. All right. So Steam's that's good. Bounce for like twenty minutes. Now I'm pretty much mainline Steam. For all my games. Right. If it, if it comes out on uh, PC as well as all the other consoles, I'm getting it on uh, right. on Steam. So uh, this library about to be huge. Right now I got Helldivers. You can try out Helldivers. I well, actually like can't do anything because you don't have yeah. Steam Deck right now. <laughs> uh, I mean, you could just plug in a controller. You could play it docked with a controller. I could, but then like, what's the point? The whole point of like is, is I like playing it in bed. Or on the toilet. <laughs> I understand. I understand. Uh, Holy Lettuce says, so we just did families, and it's five plus the starter of the family? It's technically six? Oh. Oh. I did not know that. Yeah. Okay, that's good. That's a lot. I don't think Zim is ever going to need uh, his own Steam Deck. No. It took a long time to, to reload uh, Steam right after I did Uh, will this mean no more sharing games by signing into the PC of the person now? Of the other person. Signing into the PC of the other person. No, I think it's you You sign into your own account on your own machine and the library will just be there. Yeah, you don't have to share password. I mean, you could yeah. obviously just have somebody else's games if you just log into their account mm -hmm. on your computer. Uh, but this way you don't have to share passwords and stuff. Yeah. And... and Everybody gets their own cloud saves. This is like a way cleaner way to do it. Yeah. Uh, I kind of wish more um, like Microsoft and Sony and Nintendo did that. Yeah. You know? They just know they can get away with people buying multiple copies yeah. of the same games. Uh, okay. So I did it. Uh, how do I get back to? I hate their UI is so bad. <laughs> how did I even get to the settings in the first place? Uh, oh, you're in the browser? No, I'm on a. Uh, I'm I'm on on the web client. I mean the 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 Mac client. Um, you got to go to like to click on Steam in the top corner and go to preferences. It's actually not there. Huh? It's it's not. It just says Finder. I, it's 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 bugged out. The beta Weird. is bugged. Oh, this boy. is not Steam is not a Mac thing. Yeah. <laughs> I can go to big picture mode. Try that. Big picture mode. Yeah. Is usually better. It's gonna take over the whole computer. It's gonna fuck everything no. up. <laughs> Oh no, it doesn't. It goes in a little window. That's oh, actually it's actually better. The little picture mode. <laughs> little picture mode. Uh menu. Oh, it's like <laughs> gotta load. Uh settings. Uh interface? Family. Try the new Steam Families beta feature to enable updating library parental control purchase requests for your family. Select. Select. Taking a long time. Oh, mine mine hasn't even like booted up yet. <laughs> yeah, it's pro I mean, I'd imagine that the beta is uh not yeah. at all optimized for Mac right now. All right. Well, I guess I guess uh we'll have to figure this out later. Yeah. Maybe I'll uh let me leave big picture. Oh, that was probably a bad idea. Anyway, uh, Bob joins Will's Steam family and suddenly has access to all the wa waifu games. <laughs> oh, and suddenly Will has access to all the waifu yeah. games. Yeah. Exactly. Oh, I got my I got the stuff in the corner for Steam. Now I can go to preferences. I can go to family. 
and it's still this might have to be a pc thing yeah oh no you click on it and it brings you to the okay this is it this is it i think this is it i don't know how much of this i want to show Uh, on screen create a family create a family i would love to create a family with you will uh enter family name wolves yeah adult me yeah (laughs) invite a member okay searching my friends list are we friends yeah yeah because it's like you yep and my dry bread are like the two people who pop up in my list yeah. the whole time. It says invite as an adult or invite as a child. Well, I have to renew my driver's license, so I guess <laughs> adult. <laughs> All right, you you've been invited to my family cool. plan. If Steam ever like loads on this fucking thing, <laughs> that was I easy. Will accept, yeah, that was easy. And then you can cancel the invite or resend the invite. Yeah. Very cool. Mecha Dragon, what icon is that? Well, yeah, that is a picture of Tom Hardy from Inception. I got that. That has been my Steam icon since Inception came out, and I have not changed it. The <laughs> tagline says underneath it, and it's something like, you can't tell from this picture, but I am awesome. Don't know if you've noticed, but this guy is awesome. Yes, That's what it says. <laughs> something like that, yeah. And don't, don't worry about mine. You don't yeah. have to worry about You mine. don't have to worry about that. All right, that was easy. Yeah. So uh, we'll see how that goes. What do you have that I don't have? What games do you have that I that I, I don't need? know? I I have a lot of like old Humble Bundle games in there. I got the Max Payne trilogy in there. I got the Arkham trilogy in there. Uh, I don't know. I don't. I have Hell. I have Hellblade two. The Hellblade one. Sorry. Yeah, I don't have a lot that like you're missing. There might be like one game that you see like, oh, okay. Maybe Arkham. Maybe I Arkham. Know. I don't need to replay I got, these games. I got this game, American Arcadia, because I really like the demo of it. And I've heard it's like got a really good like story. And I, I wanted to play that, but. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Is there a way to compare libraries uh, with people who you can compare like games that they have played? I don't know if there's a way to like look up other people's libraries. That seems I think like, you, seems like that'd be a breach of you have to be friends I, with them. I guess, least. yeah. All right, well, there you go. Yeah, that's uh, Steam family sharing. Uh, that'll be a fun time. Yes.